Hi everyone, it's Shay, and in my last video I showed you how to float all of the brand new ground furnishings for uh, patch 4.5. And today I will be featuring this really annoying white rectangular partition! So without further ado, if you'll notice, this bookshelf will not work with this item. So if I place and cancel quickly, it doesn't move. It, it hasn't budged. <laughs> Not much anyway. So if I take this out, and then instead we're going to use this Oasis Leaf Rug. And we're going to do the same thing, but we're going to place and cancel this, like how you would normally float ground furnishings. So I don't know if you guys can tell, but it has moved ever so slightly off the floor just by like a millimeter. You guys see that? It's tiny. It's a tiny movement. That's alright. So next we're going to use our stage panel. We're going to try and line this up close to the center. See that's... this is... this between these two points is almost dead center. So we're actually going to put it back just a little bit farther. Because we don't want the stage panel centered, we want what we're going to be floating with centered. And this thing has a tiny, tiny, most annoying hitbox. So recently a lot of people have been trying to float with this wooden loft, but as you notice it can only go so low into the ground and we actually need something that can go lower, which is your good old Riviera wall shelf. So without further ado, take grid snap off when floating this furnishing. And I'm going to go into first person so you guys can see what I'm doing. So this is... It's still like a tiny bit off the ground, but that's all we need. So we're going to try and put it as low as possible. And you can see that it moved up. And you have to keep doing this in itty bitty increments. I think I'm accidentally floating the stage panel, but that's alright. You can see that was... that was not low enough. I'm not sure why the stage panel is moving up, but I'm not going to question it right now. You can see I am gradually getting it off the ground. Oh, that didn't work. Not low enough. So you do have to you do have to move it up in tiny, tiny millimeters as you can see. So this is how people float this item. I know it's really tricky, so don't don't be upset if um, you can't get it right away. This is probably one of the most frustrating furnishings to float in the game right now. So I'm going to remember to after you get it to float, we need to I'm gonna remove this and this. Rotate the object so it'll stay in the air. And then we're just gonna leave. And we're gonna go back in. Ta-da! It's floating. So use a lot of patience if you decide to decorate with this particular furnishing, but it is possible to float, and this you can always float it as high as you want. So thanks for watching, and I hope you have a great day.